Well, obviously, Oxford reopening on Friday and Saturday nights are a commitment. Andy Lismore, are they a long-term commitment for the greyhound racing people out there? It's all been told. Funny enough, I just had a call with, with, with James Chalkley, our director of race, and I asked him that very question. And he, he said, unequivocally, yes. Um, listen, uh, fr Friday, Saturday nights, that's when owners want to come and see their dogs. Um, that's when they get the crowds, the buzz, the atmosphere. So, yeah, um, we as a group, um, as I'm led to believe, are, are committed to, to Friday, Saturday nights going forward. And so important, yeah. kind of at the heart of what Oxford is, Richard Baker, you believe it to be incredibly important. Why is that? Yeah, because uh, owners owners love to get together. They they love to go up there and have a pint or have a chat or have a cup of tea, whatever, whatever. And, you know, I've, I've got an owner, Ken Brewerton, like he said, he said, I've got no interest in buying dogs to watch them run in the betting office. He said, that don't do nothing for me. He said, I just love to go and go to the track and watch them run and, and watch other people's dogs run as well. And I think that is very important that um, we have these, like you say, going back to the old days. Um, yeah, that is that is one thing that Brian Racing has lost. And like I say, there's probably a lot of tracks that don't even, hasn't, haven't even got an evening meeting. But yeah, I'd love, I'd love to see that stay there. And it sounds like it will, and I think that will appeal to a lot of people and uh, bookmakers as well, Richard Dunn, because Friday, Saturday nights, where the pack track is when you'll have a smile on your face as well. Well, what more could you ask for? That, that's just exactly the nights you want, aren't they? Fridays and Saturdays, everyone goes out them nights. That's when you want it on. And, and it always was busy. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's great. That's great news, that is. I think we're led to believe, Andy, that fairly shortly after the reopening, there'll be more meetings, though. Is that right? Again, um, yes, I did speak to James Bruce about this. That, that's certainly the hope um, and belief. And, and, and listen, that there's going to be a nice pool of dogs to, to work with. Um, and I'm sure more meetings will, will, will come. Enough dogs? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, uh, no names of Patrick, but I know he's got, they've got a, a waiting list uh, of dogs to come in. There's a, like a phase one of, of trainers, but I, but I know there's been plenty more interest. And, and you know, uh, as and when more meetings come, then, yes, there are trainers ready, willing and able to come.